too loud. I heard you hadn't been feeling too good. Um, I'm sorry to hear that. Well, I came over and I brought a couple of things, okay? Just for you. We're gonna spend a little bit of quality time together. Okay. My favorite blanket, yeah. And um, you know, I'm just gonna wrap you up a bit because I like to be warm when I don't feel good, and it feels like a continuous hug. So I'm just gonna place it around you, okay? Okay. Okay. There we. Comfy. Okay, good. So, um, I just heard from. Yeah, she told me you hadn't been feeling good. So you know me. I had to rush over here to see you. Okay. Well, before I get near you or all that, I'm just gonna. Put some Germex on my hands. Um, good old hand sanitizer. Just to make sure I don't give you any more bad germs, okay? Okay. And you can have some too if you want. But just want to be extra careful clean <laughs> okay so you can let that dry for a minute and I kind of heard what was bothering you you know through talk but why don't you tell me what pressure on your sinus cavities. Just dab. Yeah, trying to be, you know, maternal. <laughs> I figured you would have a bit of some buildup when I don't feel that good. Um, I like you said, you haven't taken a shower yet, and those oils build up. And um, these are just good for feeling more fresh in between. So, it's just a cleansing wipe. It has um, some eucalyptus in it, some aloe, so you'll feel very, very refreshed. Okay, so we're just brushing away that extra debris and build up of oil on your face and, you know, sweat. It happens. 
happens to the best of us. But it's, it's nothing to worry too much about. You're still just as beautiful. Okay. Looking snazzy already. So, I noticed you're running low on your iron packs. I know you, you're a bit anemic, so I bought this just in case you needed it. Um, you don't have to take it right now, but I just saw you had about I'd say three packs left, so I just picked one up for you to have in case, you know, your sickness runs a bit longer than you were anticipating. You'll have this one. But I brought stuff for you to take now if you'd like. Bit of ibuprofen. These are soft gels, so if you feel like you need this, you can take it. Um, I'm not gonna give it to you right now because I'm gonna give you something else, but I will leave it here for you to have. Um, just take it if you feel you need it. I also love some tangerines for some extra vitamin C. I find fruit really does a, the body good. But what I'm going to give you now is just a bit of Alka-Seltzer plus cold. A bit of Alka-Seltzer plus cold. I brought you a glass of water. No ice, because I know how you like your water. Plus, I find room temperature when I'm sick, it just it's much smoother on your throat. And it's always good to stay hydrated. Have you been taking your liquids? Okay, good. I want to make sure of that, okay? I'm going to pop one of these in here. I'll leave you one extra. I've always thought these were really cool. I don't like taking them. But should I give you one or two? I'll give you two. Now the taste isn't the best. So I brought you a treat, in case, you know, you're a little mad at me for making you take these. So, just looks like this. This one busted a little bit. Sad face. It's okay. We'll make it work. So, we're gonna watch them fizz off. Yay! Okay. Okay. Let's do a small piece. You can see it working. A little, little small one. And the rest of that. last one in. You can see it's sizzling. No? Fizzing. It's turning. <laughs> Interesting. Milky. Fuzzy. White. can hear how it's tapping different the uh, liquid. Okay. 
gonna let that sit for a minute before I have to torture you with it. It's not that bad, but I won't lie, it's, it's not the best taste in the world, but it'll be okay. To make up for it, I brought some candy, some Snickers. Maybe that'll make up for it. I know you like Snickers. Some Almond Joy candy. And your favorite candy. All chocolate. Baby Ruth. can eat those only after you drink your Alka-Salsa. So, go ahead and have a sip. And yes, I'm gonna watch you drink it to make sure. So. Yeah, it's, it's kind of salty, but it's kind of like Think of it like fancy sparkling water. Yeah. Maybe it'll make it easier to go down. Or you can just chug it. So, another thing when I'm sick, my mom, she used to always, before we went to bed, always put on lip medics. Our lips really soft. So when we woke up, and especially when you're sick, um, sometimes your lips get chopped. And that seems like a really small thing, but on top of not feeling well, it's, it's not fun. So she would put on our lip medics for us. And it just Just take her finger, dip it so lightly, and put it on. And it has a, a minty, nice, tingly feel. And I, whenever I smell it now, I just think of her. She still wears this every night before bed. So <laughs> I'm going to pass down the tradition for you. You can have your own jar of lip medics, so put a little bit on, just like my mom used to do for me. And go like, like a little fish. Yeah. The smell, it's, it's different. It's, and it feels so cool on our lips. A nice breeze, <laughs> mint and breeze. It's, it's my favorite. And the smell, I like the smell. It can be a bit in your face, but once you get used to it, it's comforting. So I brought all that for you, and I brought a little, one more extra thing. I know, when I was young, I didn't feel well my mom would either play with my hair or trace my back with, in my case, with a feather or her fingertip, and it would just soothe me. So, I'm going to just brush it on your face with this feather. I might give you indulge myself too. And the hands were always my favorite because it was the most gentle touch. Don't worry, this feather is clean. I bought it. 
special for you. Plus, there's not many wild blue feathers. So, do you can see how soft that feels? It's a bit of a tickle, but a nice tingly. This is a really soft, textured feather, so it's not that harsh, like angry tickle. Sometimes the stiffer the feather, it'll kind of itch, so I like my feather to be soft and delicate. And so, you know, a little fun color. I would really hurt. I think this is a an ostrich feather. And I'll leave it here for you so you can think of me. Blue feather. Trace my arm with it. It's fingertips. Hopefully my visit here has made you feel a bit better. I'd say I do it more often, but that would require me getting sick more often. So let's just hang out. You agree? go now, but you know, if you need me, how to find me, right? Got my number, put me on speed dial. Okay, well I hope you get to feeling better soon, okay? Okay, take care of yourself. I'll see you later. Bye.